Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. So today we are vlogging, it is Saturday. I'm trying not to get my days mixed up, um, but I am here at my lake house. I just got back in town Thursday because I was visiting my sister in Illinois and so now I'm back and I have lots to do. So let's see if I actually <laughs> accomplish them. I woke up this morning with such a terrible headache and I don't know why I've taken two Advil and I've already drank coffee because normally I just get really bad caffeine headaches but normally that doesn't hit until like one o'clock if I don't drink any coffee um but today it like hit me at like 9 30 a.m which was not fun so I took one Advil I drank coffee I still had the headache and so I just took another Advil so Let's hope that my headache goes away because I just, it hurts. Um, but I am still kind of like being lazy right now. I actually got a decent amount of stuff done. This angle is like terrible. Um, but I just completely edited and uploaded my clothing haul. Finally, I did a Shein haul that I literally placed back in August and I finally filmed it. I filmed it yesterday and so I uploaded that today so if you haven't seen it definitely go check it out but now it is 11:44, and I'm about to go make myself some breakfast. I'm having a very late start to the morning. Um, I try to eat breakfast before I drink coffee because like when you drink coffee it's kind of like I don't get hungry anymore um, and so that's why I try to always eat my breakfast first, so I'm not like eating breakfast at like noon, which is what I'm doing right now, but since I had such a bad headache, I was like, I need to drink coffee ASAP. Like I literally like hopped out of bed and made myself coffee. Like it was so bad. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and make some breakfast. I'm gonna just do a bagel and some chicken sausage that I got from Trader Joe's. So that's gonna be the breakfast. So let's go ahead and make some breakfast. I'm not really too hungry, but I don't want to wait any longer because I have a really bad habit of waiting until I'm like starving and then I just like feel sick. Um, so yeah, also with the headache, I was wearing my glasses too because if I don't wear my glasses, I also get really bad headaches. So I literally was doing everything to get rid of this headache and it's still like not working, which is frustrating, but oh well, maybe eating will help out but yeah I'm gonna go ahead and make myself some breakfast I wanted to share with you guys what I'm doing for breakfast so I have these cinnamon raisin bagels that I got from Trader Joe's these are so good I love cinnamon raisin bagels and then I love to pair it with this smoked apple Chardonnay chicken sausage also from Trader Joe's I love to pair these together because this is like a more like sweeter type of sausage and so I like to pair it with something sweet I just feel like if I paired this with like eggs or something like I just feel like it wouldn't go good together so that's why I like to pair it or like if I were to have like pancakes or french toast like something like that I'll, I'll pair this chicken sausage with so I'm gonna be making that and then I just have some cream cheese and you guys if you guys do not own a bagel cutter what are you doing with your life? Like this literally is so good. It's so easy versus just like having to slice your bagel yourself like with a knife because these don't come sliced. Literally life hack, literally get this. And then I am watching Lindsay Hughes right now on YouTube. I love her, she is an OG YouTuber that I've literally have been watching for years. It was her, Bethany Moda and Meredith Foster. Those were like the three girls I watched like years and years and years ago um, so yeah I'm watching her video right now I'm about to start cooking and I will share with you guys the final product
right, you guys, here is the breakfast. So I just did the bagel and I put some cream cheese, as you guys saw, and then I have the smoked apple chardonnay sausage, and then I'm just going to be drinking my water with it because I already had my coffee this morning, so definitely need to hydrate. So yeah, that is the breakfast. Hello, you guys. I had breakfast. I put on my favorite little like hoodie sweater type of thing. Um, it's a fleece from Aerie, and I got it last year, and I love it. It is so soft it's so cold up here i need to put on the heat but i don't really know how to do that <laughs> um so i need to go figure that out um but yeah i had breakfast my headache is gone thank goodness i was not doing too hot this morning like i literally was feeling so bad because of this headache um i did uh, laundry so i have my I did my towels, those are in the dryer, and then now I'm doing like all my other clothes, and I've just been reading, just kind of having a very casual Saturday, and just kind of laid back Saturday, because I feel like I've been so like, go, 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 especially when I went to go visit my sister. We were just like doing so much, and so I'm ready to just kind of like, chill out for a second. Um, but yeah, I wanna share with you guys the uh, book that I'm currently reading. I also put on the, uh, fire because I'm just so cold um but I am reading this book which has been really good so far it's called hook line and sinker and it's by Tessa Bailey and this is the second book to it happened one summer and I really enjoyed it happened one summer and so I'm reading the second book I kind of like maybe want to finish it today like I have that much left so I really don't have that much more to read um but i don't know i guess we'll see where the day takes me i'm just kind of having like a very like i said just like a casual little day but also like kind of catching up on like laundry things like that um i still have like food that i made before and like put it in the freezer so like i'm not really doing much cooking right now because i already have a lot of stuff um so i took out some pasta that i made like a week and a half ago that I had in the freezer. So I took that out, so I'll have that for dinner tonight. Um, so yeah, just like a very casual day. And then my parents are coming up on Thursday and today's Saturday, so I don't really wanna buy like too much groceries and like cook too much because they'll be here and they're gonna cook <laughs> for me. Um, so yeah, that is a little update. I am just back in my little uh, reading chair and i'm just gonna keep on keep on reading all right it's a little bit later and i just made myself some dinner um this was leftover like i was saying earlier that i cooked a while ago put it in the freezer i took it out last night to defrost and here we are it's just some rigatoni noodles i used the rayo's spaghetti sauce and then there's some like ground sirloin and onion like mixed in and then I'm currently watching In the Dark. This is such a good TV show. I feel like no one ever talks about it. Season four just came out, so I just started the first episode of season four. Like I said, this show is so good, and I feel like it's so underrated. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat. I have all of my laundry hanging here to dry, and I'm making pretty good progress on my book, you guys, so I'm really excited. I think I have like 30 pages left or something like that. Um, so definitely we'll do a little book update for you guys once I'm done reading this. All right, you guys, I'm coming on to say that I finished my book. I feel like literally all I did say was read, but it was really good. And I know for the most part, I'm never really going to have like this much downtime probably ever again in my life. Um, so while I'm still like applying for jobs and job searching, I'm just kind of giving myself that time to relax and read a little bit so this book was called hook line and sinker it's by tessa bailey it's the second book in the um series the first one is called it happened one summer and that book focuses on brendan and piper and this focuses on i don't even know her name what is her name um hannah <laughs> hannah and fox and so hannah and piper are sisters and then fox and brendan are friends so this focuses on Hannah and Fox's relationship and 
I don't know, I just feel like I like Brendan and Piper better as characters. Hannah's fine. I don't really care for Fox, I don't know, I just think he's kind of annoying if I'm being completely honest. Like if you are a grown ass adult and you still can't commit to someone, like I know he had like other issues and stuff like that, but I don't know, I just feel like if you're a grown adult and you can't commit to someone, even though like that girl or like that person is like perfect for you and you still can't commit, like I don't know, I just like, it just kind of annoyed me. But, um, it was still a good book, like I still rated it 4 out of 5 stars, I still would recommend it, I liked both books. Um, I just like didn't like it as much as I liked. It happened one summer. So yeah, finished that book. I don't know, I feel like I'm just in that phase of my life where like if someone is just like being annoying, I just kind of cut them out. Um, and so the fact that like Fox couldn't commit was just really annoying me. I don't know, like I said, I'm just in that phase right now of life where I hate men and they all suck. So if someone's gonna not be true, I just mm, can't handle it. Anyways, that's my rant for the day. Now I need to figure out what book to read because I don't know. Let me show you guys the book setup. Okay, so here's the book setup that I need to organize because I now have like makeup and stuff here. Um, but these are all the books that I've read since I've been up here. I recently read The Layover. I don't think I ever did a book update on that one, but this book was really good. I also read Little Secrets. I don't remember if I did a book update in the vlog, but that one was really good as well. But like I said, always go to my Instagram because I post book updates on there. So this book will need to somehow fit right here. But now I have all of these books. Um, I recently just bought these two, so I kind of want to read one of these. I haven't read a Colleen Hoover book in a while. Um... So yeah, I have all of these to pick from. I also really want to read this one, Good Girl Complex. I just saw this at the store and it sounded really good. But I might do a Colleen Hoover because I love her and I haven't read one of her books in a really long time. So maybe I'll do that one. And then after that, I'll break it up and read maybe Such a Fun Age because I want to break up some of the romance novels. Okay, yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to read, if I can even get to it. My nails are like so long, you guys. I miss my nail guy. Okay, yeah, so I think I'm going to read that book because I miss Colleen Hoover. She has her book coming out next month, and I'm so freaking excited. I literally cannot wait to read her new book. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and maybe start reading that. I want to get some stuff done on my computer, so maybe I'll do that. I mainly was just, like, reading for a while because I was charging up my laptop. Um, because I don't always like to go on it when it's charging. Um, so my laptop is all charged now. And all my laundry is done. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do laptop work. And then maybe start my book or something. I don't know. But I wanted to update you guys, let you guys know about the book. So yeah. Hello guys. So it is the next day and I realized that I never finished off the vlog. And so... I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely subscribe if you haven't already and follow me on all my social medias. I will leave them linked down below for you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.